My name is Aaron Kalmus. I'm a project manager here on the Royal Caribbean Terminal A project in Miami, Florida. We're currently in the Port of Miami. The Terminal A project will be the home for Royal Caribbean's new ship, Symphony of the Seas, which is the largest cruise ship in the world. This project offered a lot of different unique challenges for us. The geometry of this west wall, the roof, and the east wall of the terminal. All of them actually changed direction in multiple different planes, as well as the extremely small site we had to work with. Our project perimeter only extends a few feet to the north and to the south of the structures. My favorite feature of this project is the large inverted glass wall behind us. This west wall was fabricated by our glazing contractor and shipped here. We had to build a 40-foot mock-up and it was tested for air and water infiltration. They shoot a large and small missile impact test on the glass to make sure it can withstand the hurricane winds here in Miami. This model and this job never could have been created without a collaborative effort between these contractors and the Suffolk team. This model and this job was created with input from all of our contractors. Our steel fabricator created their steel model, uploaded it into our system, and the glazing contractor then did the same. By marrying those up, we were able to make sure that each of our connections for the glazing landed at the right spot on the steel. The level of the detail that each of these contractors provided was greater than I've ever seen on another project. The team out here has been using the technology and the model throughout construction. We were able to catch about 90% of the conflicts that we otherwise wouldn't have found until we started erection. Royal Caribbean also embraces technology, and that's one of the reasons we've developed such a great relationship with them. Our Suffolk team and our trade partners have been working for the last year, day in and day out, to make sure that we deliver this project on time. And everyone's looking forward to seeing the largest ship in the world docked at this new terminal.